In this tutorial, we will be looking at how to simplify monomial rational expressions. Remember, a monomial is a polynomial with one term, like 3x squared, or xy cubed. Therefore, a monomial rational expression has a monomial in both the numerator and denominator. All of these are examples of monomial rational expressions. When simplifying monomial rational expressions, there are three steps to follow. Step 1. Simplify and remove any exponents on brackets. Step 2. Simplify any common factors between the numerator and the denominator. Step 3. Combine like terms. Simplify the following monomial rational expression. Step 1. Simplify and remove any exponents on the brackets. We can see this step applies to our numerator. x squared raised to the power of 3 equals x to the power of 6 using the exponent law for powers. Now, we have x to the power of 6 over 2x to the power of 4. Step 2. Simplify any common factors between the numerator and the denominator. We have x in both the numerator and denominator and can simplify by using the exponent law for the division of powers with the same base. 6 minus 4 equals 2, so we have x squared over 2. Step 3. Combine like terms. We don't have any like terms to combine, so our simplified answer is x squared over 2. Simplify the following monomial rational expression. Step 1. Simplify and remove any exponents on brackets. This step applies to our numerator. By applying the power of 2 to all of the terms in the brackets, we get 5x, x to the power of 4, y to the power of 6 for our numerator. Step 2. Simplify any common factors between the numerator and the denominator. First, the 5s cancel. Then, using our exponent laws, we are left with x x to the power of 4 minus 3, y to the power of 6 minus 2, to get x, x, y to the power of 4. Combine like terms. In the last step of combining terms, we combine our two x's to get x squared, y to the power of 4, which is our simplified expression. Does the order of steps matter? The answer is yes and no. Step 1 must be done first. Think back to bed mass. Brackets and exponents is first. Then comes division and multiplication, which are division, step 2, simplifying common terms, and multiplication, step 3, combining like terms. You can combine like terms before simplifying common factors. Sometimes it keeps the numbers and calculations smaller if you simplify before combining. Let's look at the previous example quickly and jump in after step 1 is complete. Now combine the like terms to get 5x to the power of 5, y to the power of 6, over 5x cubed multiplying y squared. 5's cancel and we get x to the power of 5 minus 3 multiplying y to the power of 6 minus 2. This gives us the final answer of x squared multiplying y to the power of 4. As we can see, you get the same answer each time. In this lesson, you learned how to simplify a monomial rational expression by following three steps. Step 1. Simplify and remove any exponents on brackets. Step 2. Simplify any common factors between the numerator and denominator. Step 3. Combine like terms. By following the order, it keeps more complicated problems easier to work with.